Okay, I have one slide. That's it. That's all. Yeah, so I recommend you screenshot this because I'm going to make an argument against using beautiful, polished, slick cinematic videos and uh, show it to your executive director, show it to your marketing manager. Anytime somebody wants to argue, my contact info is there. So the trend that's been happening for a few years is that videos have to be real and videos have to be helpful. Of course, a cinematic, beautiful, slick videos are, are a helpful part of your mix. But if you're, if you're a small nonprofit, or if you have a time crunch, or if you have a small budget, then the best way about it is just to make it homemade, keep it honest, keep it real, and answer some actual questions. And so let me just quickly define what does real mean in this case? It means authentic. It means use your smartphone, use what you have, be honest, show your warts, show your zits, and keep the mistakes in. Go to any of your favorite channels on YouTube and go to Brene Brown, go to Mel Robbins, go to Simon Sinek. They keep their ums, they keep their ahs, they keep their stutters, and it's real. And so that's, that's how we define real. And then how do we define helpful? Well, instead of the old days of making a beautiful brand video full of sad puppies, placing it like a billboard in the middle of a shopping mall and hoping that you grab attention, the internet is set up so that instead of just doing something fancy and big, you can literally show up and just answer questions. And so that means to be helpful. So what that looks like is search engines. We all know about SEO by now. People are actually typing questions about your service, your nonprofit, your organization, about senior programs, about have. mental health, and they're handing you topics for you to just answer on a smartphone. So how do we, just a little bit of proof of how we know that real and helpful are, are the way to go is that... Uh, Product manager at YouTube in an interview said that the authentic videos, homemade, full of mistakes, are the ones that there's a reason why corporations and larger nonprofits are spending massive amounts of cash on influencer marketing because nobody gets it more real than those people. And every marketing report is pointing to yearly increases in consumers appreciating having some form of video that just answers the damn question. And your search results, Google, DuckDuckGo, whatever you use, is increasingly prioritizing video as the top search results. So the biggest thing here is show up where people need you, and they're handing you the topics. They're handing you the questions. You just have to show up and film it and talk about it. And this is cheaper. This is faster if you're brave. And actually, surprisingly, more effective. Imagine that. It's cheaper and faster and more effective. So that's it for me. If anybody wants to, needs to build a case against their comms manager, that's my contact information. Thank you.